guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black walkthrough. Okay, guys, so here we are in Trufil City, and uh, yeah, we just took a tour of this whole city right here, and we got our asses kicked by some guy in a bike, and uh, now it's time to get our asses kicked a little bit more uh, against these guys in the cold storage. Yeah, this is one place that we do not visit, and uh, yeah, the name says it for itself, guys. Cold storage. You'll be seeing a lot of ice-type Pokemon right here. Some kids are catching and training Pokemon close to the uh, cold storage. Okay, I thought he was going to go with uh, for more. But, yeah, there will be Pokemon that you can capture around here. And uh, another cool thing about this is that it's still it's winter time. And, uh, well, we're going to be seeing a lot of snow and all that crud. And, uh, yeah, they probably will have uh, ice-type Pokemon. So I'm going to keep Shadow right in front. And here we go. Let's see what this guy has to say. Workers carry Pokemon and loads. I am a youngster. I am close to my Pokemon and we, we, we'll all co we'll cooperate well, happily. Yes, I do have a speech impediment sometimes. I don't know. So here we go. Youngster Kenneth would like to battle and he is coming out with his Whirlipede. Okay. It's a tanky of a Pokemon right there. But destroy you. Not with Shatter right here. Shatter still, still got, it still has 11 levels to go in order for it to evolve right here. And, uh, well, I'm going to be switching out right here. Let's go with Hotshot. And, uh, there comes that Poison Tail attack. Crud Basket. Doesn't poison it, but here we go. Fire Punch. For the win. Eat that. Oh, yes. Whirlipede did not have a chance right here. Look at that. Look at that. Ace grows, and uh, it's going to come out with a Carablast, so we're going to continue on right here with the uh, Hotshot. Alright, Hotshot, do not miss. Oh, yes. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. No more Carablast. Looks like a Tick or something. The Tick. You guys ever watched the Tick, the show? I have. Spoon! It's a pretty good show right there. Now, we got somebody waiting for us right here. Now, if you talk to him, he's going to be like, A helmet is an important tool for shock protection. It's good to let your Pokemon have one, too. And here we get ourselves a Rocky Helmet. And uh, if you let your Pokemon hold a Rocky Helmet, the foe will also do, will also be damaged if the foe's move makes a physical contact. So let's go right ahead and uh, give that to somebody right here. So here we go, the Rocky Helmet. I also got the Shell Bell in the last episode. Which Pokemon takes the most damage? Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and take away uh, Black Glasses. And let's give Shedder that move. And then, uh, let's see. Not that one. Expert Belt. What does this do? An item that holds a Pokemon is well worth the way. It slightly boosts the uh, super effective moves. Okay, let's give that to someone. Let's give it to Hotshot right here. And uh, let's see. Shell Bell. Let's go ahead and switch that out. Let's see, let's see. Shell Bell should probably go to Ace right Oh, yeah, it's holding the experience share. Never mind. No. And let's give the Shell Bell to Drillmonger right here. And uh, let's see, let's see. There's another thing that I have right here that can actually help us. Okay, the Scope Lens. The critical hit ratio. We're going to be going all, uh, all uh, freaking damaging right here. Let's see. The Amulet Point. We need to keep that... Let's actually give that to Gigalith right here. And let's go back up right here. And get this whole uh, amulet coin to the man who wins most of the battles right here. Let's give it to Sai of the Torrent. We will be giving it to Mystic Water back in just a little bit. So there we go. Let's go straight ahead and uh, let's go ahead and talk to this guy right here. What do you have to say, buddy? My dad is working at the gym, or in a gym. I am receiving special training here, or there. Here or there, whatever. Okay, so here we go. You are challenged by Youngster Albert, and he is coming out with the Joltik. Now, this is an interesting Pokemon. It is both a an electric and bug-type Pokemon. And, uh, it, yeah, it's a, it's, it's a pretty good-looking Pokemon right there. Don't let the size the... I deceive you or anything like that. <laughs> Don't let the size deceive you because technically it's uh, the, it's the size of a flea or something. That's what it is. And uh, oh crud! Here it comes uh, crud. That was a yeah. That was a thunder wave right there. Asshole Pokemon, you. Let's go with a thunder or a headbutt right here. Oh come on! Don't be like that. Oh god. 
Yeah, you gotta love that. You gotta paralysis. You gotta love the paralysis right there. So here he comes with a bug bite, and uh, well, it's neutral damage right there. But you did physically hit me, so you will get hit back. Look at that. And the Moxie's kicking in. Yeah, that's right. Shatter's kicking some ass. And welcome to level 29 right there. Okay, so he's coming out with a Dwebble. Let's go inside of the tower because we need the extra cash and all that stuff. The extra cash. Uh, let's go. Okay, alrighty. Let's get it with a Razor Shell. Finish this guy off right here. Crud. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. Here comes that Stealth Rock. Ah, oh, crud. Alright, let's go right ahead and use another Razor Shell. That's how you do it. That is how you do it. Alrighty. Side of the tour. Kicking ass, taking names. Alrighty. Okay. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, we already defeated this guy. Let's go right ahead and uh, talk to this guy right here. He's like, for a few loads, sent it by my Pokemon. For a few, uh, for a lot of loads, sent it by a ship. Use the best method for your needs. He, okay, so that's a good one. It's more of saying that, you know, work smarter, not harder. You know, that kind of stuff. All right, so let's see. We already went there, and I think that guy's waiting for us. So let's go right ahead and heal up our Pokemon because, uh, yeah, we kind of need to heal this guy up. So let's go with the Paralysis Heal, and let's give it to Shatter right here. And, uh... Okay, so let's go right ahead and switch out right here. Let's go... Let's go with Gigalith. I haven't seen you in quite some time. Remember in the last episode? It's been a month or something? <laughs> you can get the to the cold storage through this gap between the fence and the container over there. Okay, thank you, thank you very much. And we found ourselves a PP up, the Pokemon Viagra, and uh, let's see, there's a Pokemon chain right there. You will be able to find some interesting Pokemon right here, which uh, we probably will see, like right now. Ah, oh, crap. Not that Pokemon, we already got that Pokemon. It's a pretty strong Pokemon right there. Okay, let's see. We're gonna run away because Gigalith does not want any of that smoke right there. So let's go ahead and grab that. Found ourselves an ether. Nice, nice. And uh, let's go a little farther right here. And uh, there. Okay, I don't think that's a Pokemon. It's in the grass. Don't think it's a Pokemon. Let's see. The beer chill of the cold storage. Taste how it cold it is. Okay, let's go. Let's get this. Let's get this. Okay, so here we go. Eddie would like to battle. And he's coming out with his Band Sage, so that's good. That's very, very good. Coming with my Pokemon, my Gigalift. Let's get this. Let's go with an Air Cutter. Okay. Look at that. I'm kind of hoping that was a crit. Well, it wasn't a hit critical hit or anything like that. And he's going to come out with Timber right here. So we're going to stay put and do the same thing right here. We're going to be going straight for Air Cutters. We're going to destroy this guy. Going to destroy him like nothing. Yeah, buddy. And no more timber. Okay, so there we go with Eddie, and he, he, he's he been beaten to a bloody pulp right there. Okay, so... Okay. So this is the reason why I say, I'm say i saying it's not a Pokemon. Because, if you guys remember, in Generation 1 through whatever generation this is, 5, yeah? We've always gotten a Voltorb and an Electrode looking like a Pokeball, like an item. In Generation 5 Unova, they introduced the newest Pokemon that kind of looks like a Pokeball. Not this guy, but you guys already saw it. Fungus. I actually thought that was a Fungus. Okay, never mind. And crud! Getting attacked again. Oh, look at that! A vanilla... A Vanillite! A vanilla light. Or Vanillite. A Vanillite. I can't even pronounce that shit right. Okay, so let's get the heck out of here. We're going to be running away. Don't need to... We don't need to do anything like that, so let's go right ahead and uh, continue on our adventure to the cold storage. And uh, let's see, this guy right here is not stopping us, but this guy will. Draven. Do you think Team Plasma could be in there? I don't like cold places, but we have to check. What a bother. Alright, uh, alright, dick. Uh, I'm gonna waste a repel right here. I don't want to be attacked by another Pokemon right here. Luckily for me, I did buy myself a repel or two. Uh, 
Okay, hold on, hold on. Do I have a regular repel? Yes, I do. See, I don't really need to waste the super repels right now. Alright. And uh, let's grab this. Found ourselves another hard scale, which can we use for, uh, or we, we can use to teach our Pokemon another move. So let's go in here. The cold storage. Look at that. It is cold in here, and uh, Homeboy is like, well, still. Is there anything more important than strength of four trainers? Like the champion said. Oh, I'll never understand just by thinking about it. What a bother. Let's hurry up and check this ins uh, the inside. We will, we will. Now, we, we will be getting challenged by all these trainers right here, so let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with Hotshot right here and see if we can actually try and get it to gain some levels. We you talk through the containers, uh, some places are frozen, so you can go sledding around. Okay, let's see. Grab this. We found ourselves another netball, which is good. And uh, we won't be going anywhere right there, so let's go right here. And we are stopped. Okay, so what do you want? When it's cold, wear lots of clothes. Only humans could come up uh, with something uh, so clever. This is true. Although we are in the springtime. Actually, for the first two weeks of spring, it was pretty cold. Very, very cold from where I'm at. Unfortunately, I have to stay at home all freaking day because of this whole COVID-19 thing. Yeah, guys, well, I'm doing all of this. Uh, covid 19s going on now. I hope many of you guys are doing all, all right. I hope everything's doing, like, as well with you guys, uh, your parents, yourself, all that crud. Uh, I get it. So, uh, isolation, social distancing, that whole thing. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's annoying. It's bugging me. I'm getting cabin fever. Ugh. But everything, I hope everything's going well with you guys. Uh... My contribution to many of you guys is uh, making all these videos for you. That way you guys have something to see. I did see an increase in my uh, subscriber count, which is nice. It's always nice for all, uh, like for, for what I'm doing right here. But I'm hoping that I make a, I made your day by just making these videos right here. I have gotten uh, quite a few comments right here that, you know, I'm doing that. So that's awesome. That's great. Very, very good. Okay, so defeated that guy. And uh, let's see, who is next? Okay, so we're going to be going up here, and we're going to be getting stopped by another guy. This guy here is going to be like, You're pretty energetic considering the cold place we're in. Let's warm up with a Pokemon battle. Oh, you can say that again, because uh, I do have the right Pokemon for this job right now. Huh, chat. The awesome Pokemon. Alright, so he's coming out with a Pampor, and I picked the wrong Pokemon for this job, too. Okay, so let's go right ahead and uh, let's use its physical strength. It's pure strength. Look at that. Thrash attack. Fix his ass. Look at that. And he's going to be coming out with a timber, so it won't have any kind of a... It won't work, so let's go back to Gigalith right here. Okay. Alrighty. Let's do this. Let's do it for the bitches. That's right. Now... I'm glad that many of you guys are actually watching my Pokemon uh, Liquid Crystal walkthrough, Mega Ruby walkthrough as well. I'm just letting you guys know that yes, I will be adding some of my Pokemon that I have right here, Pokemon Black, to Pokemon uh, Omega Ruby because I'm capable of doing that now. I think it's Generation 7 I would like to say. No, oh, 6. It's probably 6. I gotta forget what generations we are in. You know, that's what happens when you're getting older. You know, you just forget. Not really. I played a lot of uh, a lot of football, so that's a lot of uh, CTE right there. Although I am in a uh, cold storage, my heart is burning. Pepto Bismol. That usually works right there. Pepto Bismol. And here we go. Felipe wants the battle, and he will be coming out with his girder. Let's get this girder. What do you got? He's coming out with a girder. Please insert girder. Okay, let's get this with the fire punch. And come on. Oh damn, he's a well. He's not much of a, a physical specimen, but all them veins, but no toothbrush right there. So let's go strength attack. Let's get it, hot shot. Ooh, an explosive attack, and no more Gurger. Okay, and uh, Ace grows to level 31, which is great, awesome, good. Okay, so who's next? Moving on forward right here, and yes, the repels worn off. Didn't really need it that much. Okay, so let's 
Let's go right ahead and heal our Pokemon right here, I think. Yeah, I got some super potions. Give that to Hot Shot. And you know what? I've been meaning to do this because it needs to be done now. Yeah, let's go right ahead and switch out to Drillmonger. This guy is about to evolve, and I almost evolved him in the last uh, gym battle. Okay, the best trainer of ice-type ice type Pokemon in the cold storage. That's me! Okay, alrighty. Let's see what you got. Okay, worker pattern wants the battle, and here he comes out with his ice-type Pokemon. Okay, it's a pretty nice ice-type Pokemon. But here is a Drillmonger, ready to kick your butt. One step at a time, and I think uh, Steel-type moves are effective, right? Yes, it is. Look at that. It's so sad that, like, this is probably the only ice type or uh, steel type move that it will do, or that can learn. And he's gonna be coming out with a timber, so let's continue on with Gigalith right here. Continue on with Gigalith, and we're just gonna destroy, destroy, destroy. Alrighty, Timber, bring it. You veiny looking mother lover. Here we go. Psybeam. For the win! Oh uh, yeah. No more Timber. Timber is leaving! Alrighty, Patton has been defeated and this guy is talking about the Isser City Gym. And uh, finally, it took us like quite a few episodes, but Drillmonger is finally evolving. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Drillmonger! Digivolve too. Got its final evolution form name. <laughs> That's how much I keep up with the the evolutions right now, guys. It is digivolving. It is digivolving right there. Look at that. To an Exadrill. Oh yeah. Okay, so now it's learning Horn Drill, and uh, well, if you guys already know what Horn Drill is, let me just show you. It's only five PP. But its accuracy is 30%. That is horrible. But you hit the person, it's a one-hit KO. The only thing is, I don't want to use it. It's not worth it. It is not worth it. But you finally get yourself an Exit Drill right here. Let's go right ahead and take a look at our new Pokemon, Exit Drill. It's been a while. Look at that. Ground and Steel Tap Pokemon. And uh, let's see. Very good speed. Physical attacker. Its defense is shitty, but its special defense is pretty good too. So that's uh, that's also good. So it, it hopefully it won't get hit physically. Although you know what? Maybe I should <laughs> maybe I should give that uh, the item to uh, to Drillmonger since its physical defense is uh, not that great. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, let's go back up here. Where are you? Get back up here. Okay, so we're gonna be giving the Rocky Helmet to Excadrill instead. Mainly because, you know, if it's gonna get physically attacked, why not let them pay for it while doing so? And let's give that Shell Belt to Shatter right here. And, uh. Let's see. Is there anything else? Yes. You know what? Let's put Shatter back up. And uh, we still got two more Pokemon that need to get to level 30, so let's go right ahead and do that. Look at that. Ice Heal. Don't necessarily need it anymore because it kicked everybody's butt kicked everybody's ass, I guess, and, uh, well, let's go straight forward right here, and is there a trainer waiting for us? Yes, there is, he's waiting for us, let's see what you gotta say, ready to battle, yep, okay, let's get this worker, Ryan wants to battle, and he's coming with his timber, and me, I am uh, coming out with a Shedder. Now, the only downside to this one is that Shedder is a Fighting-type Pokemon, so or a Dark-type Pokemon, so it will get hurt. So let's go right with the Headbutt. Hopefully, we can finish this guy off right here. And what the hell happened? Oh, yes, we're getting a little bit of experience. Or, no, not experience, but a little bit of HP right there. That's good. And let's go Brick Break again. And crud, this guy has gone for a Bite Attack. Okay. That's one, and uh, that takes care of that. So scared, very, very scared. And there it comes that Moxie, just like John Moxley right here. And come on, bring him out, Timber. I'm gonna continue on right here with Shatter, just because it has that Moxie attack or Moxie effect. Let's get this brick break. 
Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Takes care of that. And more Moxie. Oh, yes. And uh, more healing. Okay, so that's a good combination right there. And he'll be coming out with the Vanilla Light. Vanilla Light. Vanilla Light. That's how you say it. Vanilla Light. Eat this Brick Break. Oh, yes. Okay. Look at that. It kind of it kind of sounds like he just broke a broken a shell or something, or broken a, a a mirror or something. Okay. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. So let's go right ahead and grab this, and uh, here we have a hyper potion. And is there anything else in here? No. Okay. So we're gonna reach the very end right here. This is the very end, and of course, Sharon is gonna. <laughs> He lets me battle everybody, and this guy just like, you know, I'm gonna hog all the glory. Oh, is someone in there? I guess. Shall we go then? Eh, uh, probably. Where the hell were you, asshole? See, this is why I like Bianca better than you, you jerk. Alright, so once you go into the storage room right here, you're gonna be seeing a buttload of Team, Gl or team Plasma members, and <laughs> Zinzolin, one of the Seven Sages, is like, All of you huddle around me, I can't take this cold. An old man right there, man. It is true. Whatever. I can't believe uh, you were really hiding. It's a bother. But if you are, uh, if you're cold, shall I show you outside? <laughs> Pokemon are our king's friends. Well, we're taking care of them. We can't let them uh, any harm come to uh, to them here. Everyone, drive these intruders away. Okay, understood. Zolin of the Seven Sages. Put them up. Because we're here, or here we come. Alrighty, look at that. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. When they spread out, it doesn't... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, damn. It's a lot of people. Draven, let's each take care of one side. Alright, bring it on. Bring it. Okay, you mother grabbers. Let's go. Uh, let's go with Ace right here. Let's take care of business right now. Okay. In this group, I'm fairly strong. And that's a fact. Whatever you say, homeboy. Whatever you say. Here we go, going up against a Team Plasma member, and he is uh, packing with two Pokemon. He's coming out with his Mod Jug, and I'm coming out with the 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 man, the myth, the legend, Ace, the Wonder Dog, or you know, he's about to evolve into Stoutland from Scotland. There we go. Look at that. Rock Smash does it. Put that freaking hypnosis. God dang it. Ah. Uh, uh, this is the reason why I hate Watchog. Looking at me with those beady eyes and all that crap. Okay, so let's go with the Awakening. Let's get this. Awakening. It does it. Wakes. And there's that Super Fang. And it takes half my HP. So, let's go with the Rock Smash again. Finish this guy. Yeah, buddy. Say goodbye to Watchog. Ace is granted, and uh, here he's coming out with a Scraggy, so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with the Scraggy, the Scraggy of our own right here. Alrighty. Alrighty, okay, Scraggy. Let's get this. Alright, Brick Break for the win. And uh, that takes care of that Scraggy, look at that. More Moxie for this Pokemon right here. Oh yes, it's powering up into a Super Saiyan Dark, and uh, yeah, you gotta love that Shell Bell right there. And uh, no more Team Plasma right there, not really. Long live Team Plasma! And you are, you are like the worst right now, so let's see. The Pokemon that work with Pokemon may look like uh, they're having uh, fun, but the truth is, the truth is they're suffering. There's no doubt about it. What are they brainwashing you with? Okay, let's battle this girl right here, and uh, let's take care of another, let's take care of this again. All right, so here we go. Team Galactic Drunk wants to battle, and she's coming out with her Lightbird. Okay, so it's the, it's the battle of Kitty Cat versus uh, Doggy Dog, Snoop Doggy Dog versus uh, Kitty Cat right here, and uh, let's go with that where Rock Smash and wow, coming with that uh, Formant attack. Alrighty, so let's go Rock Smash. Nearly takes this guy out. Let's go again. Can't use it again. Crud. Take down attack. Sacrifice that body. Uh, geez. Here we go. With that pursuit attack. And, uh, well, here we go. Take down attack. Does its thing. Say goodbye. 
and say hello to level 32. What's up? What is up? Okay. Level 32. Freaking awesome. Okay. Alrighty, so you guys probably already know what that means. Oh, yes. <laughs> Ace is finally evolving. Oh, yes. Ace digivolved to Stoutland from Scotland. It's a pretty nice, good Pokemon right there. I remember getting them in the very first episode. I remember it. My very old Pokemon Black Walker when I had this guy. You can learn any elemental move. And this guy right here, oh my god, he's a tank of a Pokemon. What's up, Stoutland from Scotland? Oh man, I missed you, man. I missed you. It's a great, it's a great A mustache right there. Okay, so I'm not gonna read this. Let's go right ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon, Stoutland from Scotland. Look at that. Naughty Nature, he has that gruff. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that. And it stats. Nice. It's a good doggy. Good, good doggy. Now. Let's see, we gotta switch out our Pokemon right here, since we already got that. You know what, let's go with Sign of the Torrent. He hasn't battled in quite some time. And I could probably teach it a few good moves right here, hold on. Yeah, they, they, they're, yeah, they're quite a few, let's see, Volt Switch, let's see if it could learn that. Let's see, nope, it can't. Crap baskets, okay. All right, fuck it, let's go, let's battle this lady. Team Plasma. In my own way, I am strong, or I am a strong part of the Team Plasma group. Whatever. Alrighty. Let's go. Battling Team uh, Galactic Grunt, or Team Plasma Grunt, and she will be coming out with her Trubish. But I'm going to be coming out with Sigh of the Torrent. Alrighty, buddy. Let's take care of this. Let's go. Let's get this Razor Shell. Okay. Alrighty, look at that. Look at that, look at that. And, uh, well, that was easy. <laughs> okay, so that was one, that was a little bit. So I'm not, I'm not gonna read that. I'm just gonna battle, battle you right now. Alright. Let's get this. So who's next? Team Plasma Grunt wants the battle and, uh, coming out with the sand dial, so I'm gonna take care of it with Sigh of the Torrent, because he does have the move capable for this guy right here. Two moves, I should think. Uh, probably three, I don't know. Let's go. Razor Shell, let's get it. Look at that. Razor Shell takes care of Sandile. It had nothing, it had no chance. No chance whatsoever. And he's gonna be coming out with a Wand Jog. Okay. I'm gonna destroy the crap out of this Pokemon right here. Let's go. Revenge Attack. Oh, good thing too, because it just hit me first. It takes half my HP. But you're about to take this right here. Oh yes, revenge, super powered. Oh yes, Watchog eliminated. What now? What now? Okay, alrighty. It's so cold. How could I win when I'm shivering so hard? And just like that, look at that. Clay and his crew. He's like, well, I'll be. I didn't in a chilly old place like this. You guys, you guys take these Pokemon robbers. Roger. Who's Roger? I don't know. Roger. Whatever. All right. They're going to uh, tally up all these guys, you know, just like a herd and all that crud. Okay. All righty. All righty. They're all leaving. Yeah, get the F out of here. <laughs> They're all getting rounded up. That's right. Say goodbye to all these guys right here. Okay. What's next? You guys ain't so bad. Yep, a promise is a promise. Come on in and challenge my gym. All right. All righty, so let's see. Uh, whatever, Team Plasma's ideal. Separating people and Pokemon. It's exactly the same as not having Pokemon in this world at all. Pokemon in, or wait, wait, wait. That bunch, uh, that bunch is a waste of oxygen. Wow, Draven, it's, it's cold. So I'm getting out of here. Yeah, get out of here. Man, you are such a diva. Okay, so there is one more thing we need to grab right here, and that is this. We got ourselves the Never Melt Ice, which, uh, you know, powers up any kind of ice type moves right there. And, uh, well, let's get the heck out of here. We finally accomplished this whole cold storage place, and uh, we got bigger fish to fry, which is, you know, getting another gym badge after a month of not getting one. Literally another a month, because that's when I started this whole thing right here. Alrighty, okay, let's do this. Big Pippin walking like a pimp right here. 
So in our next episode, we will be going into the Drift Vale uh, City Gym and uh, challenging the gym leader right there. He has given us permission and all that crud. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time.